It's a beautiful day down here at the Telkitna Roadhouse. But it's not where German climber Jost Kobosch wants to be. He has higher aspirations. I basically came to Alaska to uh, do a solo winter climb of Denali. It's an expedition he says he spent a year and a half saving money and planning for. All paperwork was done. The only thing left was a meeting at the ranger station, whose doors are now closed. Prepared my gear, and then the National Park was sending me an email. It was like, hey, Ost, um, we are facing a shutdown. Um, this might be the last message you get from me. Um, just watch the news. Tired of waiting for the shutdown to end, Kobosh changed his plans. He'll attempt a winter climb of Cahiltna Queen, which sits at 12,380 feet. An impressive climb, but not the mountain he wanted. It's kind of a very big failure. I mean, it's one thing if you're on the mountain and it's windy and you're, you're forced to return by a storm. It's another thing to be forced to return because of some government bullshit. Kobosh and his film crew land on the Cahiltna Glacier. In spring, this valley is packed with climbers. But in January, it's an empty expanse, with temperatures sometimes hitting 50 below. I climb some other stuff, prepare myself, and come back next year. Because for Kobosh, a wintry summit of Denali cannot be ignored for long. He plans to return to his job, climbing Denali, after the United States government returns to theirs. John Thane, KTVA 11 News.